Yeah, when it comes to money, man, um, people think it's easy because you got money. It's way harder on all levels of everything you do, where you go, you know what I'm saying, when you go, girls you fuck with. Everything is elevated to protect the shit that 99% of people would never have. So that burden is on you. Your, your mom bills burden on you. Your friend you knew from second grade burden is on you. Your cousin that you barely knew, didn't even know you was your cousin, is burden on you. So people don't understand the level of that shit, especially when you like the first one that really made it, made it. It's heavy, bro. It's, it's heavy. Crazy. Everything you're saying is like my story. Bro, I done lived it. Burden, you know take care of my mom. Talk you know to him. But that's what I do this for. For like, sure. Bro, let's get that straight. Like, yep. That's why I do this, so I can take care of my mom. But, um, you know, it's, it's a lot. You feel me? Yeah. Like, um, thank God I got a mom that, like, is not materialistic. She don't really want for much. Mm -hmm. My mom really chilling, bro. Like, my mom really like my homie. You know what I'm saying? Right. But um, it's a lot, bro. Yeah. It's, it's more than people ever can fathom. And only how you gonna feel it is when you get to it, because everybody told us more money, more problems. We laughed at them. Give me, the, give me all the money, motherfucker. Give me the problem yeah. until you get these motherfuckers. Well, you gotta pay these bills every month. Yeah, when bro. you think of maintenance, when you think of okay, I'm I'm 42, so I'd be like, okay, I can at least get another 40 out of this shit. Damn, like how I'm living? Can this stretch another 40? This shit look good now, but I gotta. I'm gonna be an old man now. I can't be running around hustling forever. Like, what's gonna be making money while I'm sleep? I gotta think like that. I wanna have my same lifestyle. Like regular people don't got. Deal with that shit because they got a consistent job. They got 401k, all that shit that they got almost guaranteed, and it's simple. Yeah, bro, it's like everybody want to have a million dollars. Everybody want right. to make it. Everybody want to be a boss. Everybody, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, I salute all that. You know what I mean? Like, follow your dreams, go crazy. But right. Again, like, once you get to this point, it's not what you think. It's like, not what you think, bro. You know what I mean? It's a lot that come with it. You know, yeah. that overhead, more money, more problems, Oof, right? And of course. And it's like. Bro, the more money you got, you know, your lifestyle, you know, is going to up and up and up. And it's just like crazier overhead. You know right. What I'm and it's like, if you don't want your family, you got to keep up with that or else, you know what I mean? You got to keep up with it. And it's over with. And then yeah. like, even if you bless them, when it's time to be like, hey, I got to, can't do it this month. Oh, they going to hate you. I yeah. done took care of you for fucking nine months. I done took care of you for nine years. That one time I say no, it's fuck me. And no one ever did shit for me. Yeah, bro, like, having money, it, it gets weird with, like, sure. your ones, like, your closest people sometimes, you know what I mean? So, I feel like my advice to people with money, bro, just never overdo it, you know what I'm saying, with your <laughs> loved ones, like, never, you know what I'm saying? Like, you got to make sure you're straight before you make sure everybody else is straight, you know right. what I mean? Straight up, bro. Like, you got to be selfish in a way. You yeah. Be 100, like, you feel me, so. Because you got to maintain this for the rest of your life. Like, that what we get caught in and we get lost in is that, yeah, it's fine now. The first couple of years you got these M's, that shit ain't no money, brother, when you got that overhead. You know what I'm saying? So it, the key is, of course, keep that money coming in, but make sure that overhead is low. And it's, and it's hard to do. You from Jersey. I'm from the streets. Like, we ain't thinking about no overhead. I'm thinking this is going to last forever. I'm going to run it up. Get oh, yeah. me everything. I want every car, every piece of jewelry, bitch. I want every. I want Louis Vuitton every day. I want, I want Gucci socks and drawers. I want the motherfucking, I want the uh, Fendi soap. I want everything. What the fuck is you talking about? I want the motherfucking Versace plates. Why not? Thanks. Shit me. When the motherfucking bills start stacking up and then the beats ain't going as fast as it used to go, god damn. Because them, them bills keep coming. Yeah. They don't stop. And it's different between buying shit and having bills. Oh, yeah. We could buy a lot of shit. But when you got something you got to pay every month for years, that's different. That's that overhead. You know what I'm saying? So I always advise people, man, enjoy your life, but, man, be cautious. You know what I mean? It's not going to last forever, and you want to be comfortable. That's the key.